In our first video, we explained how to use the SMART method for shaping the goal of your campaign. In this video, we will use the same example, lobbying for the end of financing fossil fuels by the European Central Bank. We will cover the strategy, stakeholders and tactics. Let's start with the strategy. The strategy describes the main device or lever that will create change. We asked ourselves the question, how are we going to successfully push the ECB to divest? and decided that we want to create pressure from different angles and actors to generate a sense of urgency. You should define your allies, enemies and neutral stakeholders. Here, our allies are environmental organizations and movements, green political parties and the renewable energy market sector. Actors who are opposing our cause are the fossil fuel industry. Our fellow citizens, who haven't formed an opinion yet, are neutral and we can try to bring them on our side. Tactics describe the specific actions that follow from the strategy we chose. For us, the first step is to gain a network of at least 10 supporting organizations, institutions or movements, helping us to lobby the ECB by 2023. Together with them, we will launch an online information campaign alongside an online petition to be signed by the public. Later, we will send the online petition to the ECB. To make sure that the public is aware and to increase the pressure, we will use digital activism methods. Think of Twitter storms, influencer endorsements on TikTok or Instagram, podcasts or even getting musicians to create a song. Now you know how to structure your campaigns well. Just remember these keystones. Goals with the smart tool, strategy, stakeholders and tactics. Good luck making the world a better place.